Oh my goodness. Game changing news. <laughs> OB1 plays. Yes, right. What's up? All Hello, right. OB1 plays. Everybody, how are y'all doing? We have huge, a couple of dope gaming news items for this video. The first one is huge. But before we get started, give the video a thumbs up. Let's get it over 300 likes. Let's go. Sony PlayStation has just bought evo this is what they tweeted out on the official twitter welcome evo into the playstation family sony interactive entertainment and new sports ventures rts have jointly acquired the evolution championship series for those of you that don't know evo is the largest fighting championship worldwide tournament series in the world nothing is bigger than evo and the fact that sony has bought this organization they planted their stake into next gen and the fighting community in general now for a good minute though if you go to most fighting um tournaments and what controller they've been using, it was a DualShock 4. They're using the PlayStation 4 controller, partially because the Xbox One D-pad was widely criticized. The Xbox D-pad in general has been criticized, but now that Sony has officially partnered with Evo, you could be going to tournaments and all you see are PS5s. This is what this is, a huge, marketing move plastered on the walls of evo posters on screens are going to be playstation 5 material commercials etc bro last gen street fighter 5 was a console exclusive to the playstation brand and i was partly saying they need to just have the game for all consoles so <coughs> more people can play it whatever but it was also available on pc and xbox pc they're sort of blending anyway but this has me to think maybe street fighter 6 is going to be a playstation exclusive too this is huge sony has bought evo smash brothers is at evo mortal kombat is at evo street fighter is at evo what else is i think fighters um, um, Dragon Ball Fighters is at Evo. Is Killer Instinct at Evo? Just imagine, bro, an Xbox exclusive fighting game, and all you see is PS5s all around you, bro. This is a big, big, big move by Sony. And I tell you this, um, last week or the past few days, Xbox has been stealing the news with Outriders coming. We're gonna talk about Outriders later, but with Outriders coming to Game Pass day and day, Octopath Traveler coming to um, Game Pass. They've been stealing some of the, the news, but Sony recently have been countering. I just talked about yesterday, the all new PlayStation 5 VR controllers were revealed and bro, they look fire. Has me hyped for, um, for PS5. Uh, PSVR also Sony has been in the news with this Evo this Evo news I'm telling you man they're starting to turn it around they also had 10 free games this week um, um, Horizon Zero Dawn will be free no subscription no PlayStation Plus 
just the fact that you own a PlayStation console, they're giving you Horizon Zero Dawn for free, which is huge. Speaking of huge news, bro, the Square Enix presentation exceeded my expectations. While this was going on, I was thinking to myself, bro, this is low key better than the last Nintendo Direct and the last PlayStation State of Play. I liked it. Other than them spending too much time on that um, Life is Strange game, that was the only downside. Everything else was a black female protagonist in a Square Enix triple a rpg bro that's huge when project Athea was first announced and like, this is a day one cop and and, and if y'all watch my reaction i said it too i said did y'all see that was that a black female as the main protagonist in a square enix game that is history make gameplay bro that the CGI was lit when they showed the gameplay. I was I was already sold. This game looks insane. This is probably my most anticipated game for 2022 right now. Whoa! Square Enix Project Athia is now forespoken. Forespoken day one by just looks amazing ella balinska is the actor who will be playing the main protagonist can't wait can't wait and so that was huge 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 also in the square enix presentation marvel avengers marvel avengers has officially come to next gen i downloaded the game on my ps5 yesterday i will be on my gaming channel Obi-Wan plays gaming championship. That's where I do my the bulk of my gameplay. I'll be playing this also with the sponsors on multiplayer mission. I don't know if you could do the single player, the main campaign multiplayer. If you can, I'll do that as well. But I will be on my PS5. The game now is 4K, 60 frames per second. Now you're playing with power. Now I'm gonna really, really, I'm gonna beat this game on my PS5. This game came out the same day as 2k and you already know 2k that's my main game bro speaking of 2k tonight um 2k club event any sponsor that wants to run with me in 2k on the ps5 i need two dudes to run so um marvel avengers marvel avengers um has launched officially on the ps5 and i will be playing it but that wasn't even the highlight voice spoken was a highlight but this right here, Wakanda forever. Black Panther DLC is coming to Marvel Avengers. I think it's this year, 2021. Yeah, this year. This is what many are saying possibly saved this game. The internet went crazy when this was in Look how lit he looks, bro. And so there's going to be a Wakanda story arc to Marvel Avengers. No brainer. Yes, later this year. War for Wakanda coming out this year. You already know. Day one. Bye. They also, in the Square Enix presentation, did talk about quickly a game that i'm super hyped for outriders outriders there is a demo available now go and check out the demo the game launches april 1st this is gonna be my april game now man i'm um, gonna be playing this on the play playstation 5 uh, with the sponsor links in the description on how you could game with your boy but i'm um, definitely definitely gonna be on this outriders and so that was a square enix um, that was not just the Square Enix presentation. That's all the lit news items for today. Especially Sony buying Evo. Big boss move. They are stamping their stamp.
fake down for this generation, bro. What do you guys think about Sony buying um, Evo? All the news we talked about in this video, sound off in the comment section below. I want to know. But before you go, bro, long live the king, the original Black Panther. Click that subscribe button. Stay up to date. All things gaming, bro. We out. Peace.